Comics of 100 Years Ago, December 2nd, 1924. It's Little Orphan Annie by Harold Gray. Annie is in her new polka dot dress. She is mopping the floor of the bottle store, and Mrs. Bottle looks over and says, Hurry up, Annie. When you get the store all scrubbed, come to breakfast. Gee whiskers, Annie says, that's music. I smell bacon and eggs and buckwheat cakes and sausage. Oh boy, I'm sorry for the poor kids back at the home who just get milk and mush. And now we see the Bottle family table. Mother and father Bottle are sitting in chairs while all of the children just sit on crates. There are seven Bottle children. The father of the family, who we have not yet seen before, is a bald man with a big walrus mustache. He says, hey, you young shrimps, drop that sausage. I'm not through yet. You eat your mush and milk. Two of the kids are reaching for one sausage. One cries, oh, gee, pa, just one. Annie has quite a shocked expression on her face and has a question mark above her head. Mrs. Bottle is munching an egg and says, tut, tut, children. Sausages and eggs and buckwheat cakes are for grown-ups. They're too rich for little stomachs. Nice mush and milk. That's the ticket for little ones. Annie goes back in the store and she looks over her shoulder saying, Jumpin' jiggers, mush and milk just like at the home. And there isn't one of those little half pint bottles with as much table manners as an Airedale pup. The home wasn't so high toned, but it makes this place look like the sixth basement.